Buenas. Why I'm so red? So what just happened in the last couple of days or like the last 10 days I think I've been to a place where we had bonfires and all this stuff like just chilling around doing nothing because the weather was so good just laying at the beach I did some yoga I did some meditation I did like all this stuff and then oh my god guys sorry for the bad quality but I'm on the radio and like I don't know I'm so excited uh, in like 15 minutes I'm so excited oh my goodness it looks like a mess in here just took a shower you know blah blah, blah. Oh, I'm so oh yeah I'm excited and now we're gonna head the place where we're supposed to work and because I need to print something and I also need to refill my water so if you're constantly on the road and you're constantly driving at some point I just felt like not motivated at all to drive somewhere but the problem is I get bored really, really fast. So that's a struggle. If you're bored and you're not motivated at all to drive the engine, it's like a bad combination. But now I got out of this bad mood and now we're gonna head to, yeah. So we started again to light up. I think it's the oil because I had some oil problems. So I went to the mechanic, but I think I lost a lot of oil. So we're gonna refill the oil. I think I have some stuff left. I, my hands were probably look like shit after that, yes. So we have arrived. There is the water stuff, but I have to wait. There it is. It's always a struggle, like I really have to fix this because it always open while I'm driving, so I really have to fix this. Oh, and by the way, here at the gas station, you can... You can fill up water for like two years for 100 liters. I only need, I don't know, 20, 25, but... But this guy in front of me probably needs 300 liters, so it takes three hours. Still have some last hours from yesterday. So I'm gonna eat something while I'm waiting that he fills up his... By the way, it's like 18 degrees, 19 degrees. And it's so hot, like yesterday was 19 degrees and I felt like literally 28. I'm excited for the summer. <laughs> oh my goodness. And you know, every time I'm driving, I feel like I'm, I'm just waiting that something happens with the van. Because I'm just so used to it that the oil leaks or I don't know, the gas pedal bro uh, breaks in two or whatever. I'm so used to it. Oh my god, I think they're finished. Oh, for her. Uh, here we go. But he loves to play with the water, to be honest. I'm gonna see that now. He's just waiting that water is coming out of this. Buddy, stop it. No, there's no water to play. Oh my god. Look, look what you just did. Uh, by the way, the guy in front of me, he was yelling at me because I was staying on the other, like, I was parking wrong he said something like that he was screaming at me i was like calm down chill you can still pass me oh my god people are you on vacation chill down sun is shining why you're so mean so because i'm such a good person there was one van behind me they also wanted to refill the water and i said yeah you can use the rest of mine you know I paid for 100 liters, you still have 70 left, or 75 liters left, so I use this for free. <sighs> I'm so kind. What a difference. You see this over there, and then you see this up there. It's like <laughs> up there, the rich area, down there, the normal people. It's like the same with having a van. Like you have the rich ones and then you have the normal ones <laughs> and you know what five days ago I got registered by the police here in Portugal <laughs> because we were staying at this beach for like five days six days and then the police came and said we have to leave and then they registered everything like they registered uh, my license plate they even took a photo of my van and now I figured out that because I'm registered in their system if they catch me again I'm getting in trouble and have to pay like between 150 and 200 euros. That pretty much sucks. But you know, that's a problem here in Portugal because you have so many vans and they even park where they're not allowed to park. So, and they leave trash and all this stuff everywhere. So, 
um, the police having an eye on every spot that is basically on park for a night. So that's a struggle. I was looking for a place now to go, um, but it was literally almost impossible to find on the west coast a place where you can stay legally and without getting in trouble. And now, since I'm registered, I'm, yeah, <laughs> I'm in trouble. So, if you plan to go with a van to Portugal, just be prepared that the police is everywhere, like literally everywhere. So, um, but not in this spot actually. Anyways, just be prepared and, um, yeah. <laughs> Enjoying life, positive vibes. <laughs> Fish, I'm almost drunk. What happened? And oh my god, it's going to be an interesting way down. Okay, the way down is way more complicated, so see you down there. Over there. Oh, good morning guys, it's the next day. And I'm more surprised that it looks so dirty after one day, like... There's nothing better than waking up and the sun is shining, you can literally wear summer clothes. I love that. It's such a good morning. That's ridiculous, guys. I paid for like 24 pages, 15 euros. When he said 15 euros, I was like, we have made it, buddy. So yeah, this one goes now 36 minutes. At a search sign, there are no dogs allowed. Whatever, whatever. Oh, you know, see what just happened while I was driving. Oh, damn it. He just gave up. That's the reason why I don't have plans or anything. We have arrived. What a lovely spot. It's really, really nice on their surface inside. The water. Oh my god, I wish I had my surfboard. But no. Give me this. Yeah. Who wants the ball? Who wants the ball? Making the dishes is, oh my god, making the dishes is one of my favorite things. Really minimalism, I can't spell this word, minimalism, minimalism, I think that's kind of the, the right thing, right? Yeah, I'm trying to be really minimalism <laughs> with water, oh my god, it stinks like hell, why? Uh, is it the water? I don't know. What a beautiful morning. Sun is shining. So because I'm feeling like a little bit sick and usually I drink coffee in the morning and I tried it but you know I'm feeling like I'm just feeling sick. So I'm getting some ginger, some honey, some hot water, put it in here and trying to get fresh again. <laughs> Thank you. 
You know what I love the most about this front here? I can literally sit on the passenger seat and have my table on here. And have this view. But buddy, I think we have to talk about something. It's definitely time that I can sit on here, enjoy the view while you driving. Huh? While you driving. Now it's your turn. We drove over 8,000 kilometers now, so I drove. Now it's your turn. It's quite windy today, like... But it's so warm. T number 207 today. Okay guys, to be completely honest, I never had a plan, like a financial plan. And I think now, it's time to do it. So. Um, I never had a budget, like, you know, I was, of course I was looking for, like, the cheapest thing. If I went grocery shopping, I thought, no, I'm gonna take the cheese for, like, this instead of, like, the higher one. Um, but now I think it's just time to organize myself a little bit more because now it's just not a vacation or, like, a trip for, like, a couple of months. Um, now it's my life, so I really have to calculate some... Just my budget, you know, what I still have on my bank account, what I need, um, how long I have to work over the summer um, to earn some money, and yeah, just to have like a plan because I have no plan how much money I spent. I tried it a couple of times, but it's like so hard. We changed location, we changed location, and it always looks like this. Oh, yeah, great. This. But yeah, it's beautiful and I know. By the way, I'm that kind of van lifer that just cooks every two days. So like one day, it's just bread time, you know, just getting like some unhealthy stuff or not so. <laughs> like just bread, you know. And then the other day, I'm gonna cook. And today is a second day. And that means... Spaghetti! And I also got, um... This like... <sighs> carbonara thing you know I have a lot of them um, in different kind of flavors like spicy not spicy pesto not pesto you know all this stuff because it's the easiest way to cook and I'm because I'm a really lazy cooker if I would do like all this stuff like this fancy van life food stuff I would probably never eat because I am way too lazy so this is the best option with the van, the trees. I got my candles on and I think I'm gonna end this vlog here now because I think it's long enough and I don't know if you like this kind of thing like if I'm doing like so let me just know if you like this kind of vlogs where I put three together like three days in one vlog or if I should just do one video with one day like you know what I want to say I'm gonna edit this now and then we're gonna see what's going on next. So, gonna see each other in the next video. Peace out and bye bye.